All right, then welcome back to another episode of the Tempest Rising podcast. I'm going to keep this short and sweet today because I have a sore throat. So today's episode is going to be more of a thought. It's going to be something for you to contemplate rather than a full blown practical lesson. But I will also be giving you access to some practical stuff towards the end. So onwards with the lesson. Now, many of you will be familiar with Tony Robbins. He's probably the single most well-known figure in the personal training, uh, personal training, personal development industry and has been for a very, very long time. And he has a lot of really good ideas. Um, He's a brilliant businessman and his work has helped thousands of people across the world. There are a few things in the way he talks to people and some of the things he advises that I'm not entirely on board with. Um, but fundamentally he has some really good ideas, um, one of which has always stuck with me. It might be his most famous phrase, so chances are you've heard him say it, and if you haven't heard him say it, you've probably heard me say it before, and it is this, where focus goes, energy flows. And this is so incredibly true, because when we give something our focus, we give it our energy. And attention is the precursor to focus. So as soon as you start to give something your attention, even if it doesn't result in it becoming your full focus, it's still sapping your energy. Therefore, to save energy or to increase um, the daily availability of your energy, you need to stop paying attention to things that are irrelevant to whatever it is you want out of your life. So gossip, news, crappy TV, social media, um, people that don't serve you, all of these things take your attention. And with that, they take your energy. And in removing these things, you should see a dramatic increase in your energy levels. It's a case of less is more, really. Um, People are often the biggest culprits in this. You've probably heard uh, heard them referred to as time vampires or energy drainers. Um, When I used to work in the golf shop, we used to call them Tiger Woods which means TWs, which is short for time wasters. They're the people that just want your attention. They want to take your time, they want to take your energy, and they give you nothing in return. They're of no use to you whatsoever, and they're actually harming you and your ability to get things done. If you can learn to minimize these types of interactions, then you can save your energy for the things that matter. And I'm not saying that you need to be 100% focused and never have any fun or cut all social ties or all that kind of stuff. That's not what I'm saying. What I am saying is you need to choose wisely where you place your attention because attention requires energy. And if you're too tired to do the things you want to do, it's worth considering where your attention is going each day and how it could be better placed. And it's a very simple concept and it's not the easiest thing to do. Um, There are ways to make it easier. There are things you can do to learn where your attention is going, um, but I'm not gonna get into that now. But there are lots of other practical things that you can do to increase your energy. And what I want to give you is five of my best energy hacks. These are practical things that anyone can do every day for free to give yourself a massive energy boost. So if you are interested, I'm going to put a link in the comments and that will take you to download a workbook. Within that workbook, you'll then be able to join me inside of the Limitless group and you'll be able to take part in a five day energy challenge. Along with the workbook, you're going to get five coaching videos on five different energy hacks, plus accountability, um, question and answer pieces, pretty much anything you need to start maximizing your energy. Because energy is the universal currency for creation and without it, you can do nothing. So as your call to action today, I want you to do three things. The first thing is to write down three things that have taken your attention today and consider if they were useful um, towards your energy. The second thing is to download your workbook. The link is in the comments. And the third thing is to get in the group and to start working through your challenge. 
The group is organized into units. So as soon as you hit the group, if you hit the units tab, you will see five day energy challenge. There's loads of things in there. There's extra resources um, for each day. There's the coaching videos. There's so much stuff in there. So uh, get onto that and have a look. And remember that where focus goes, energy flows. So put your attention on the things that matter. Now that's going to be all for today. I've, uh, I said it's going to be short and sweet because of my sore throat. So if you go get your call to action done and then I will see you inside of the group. Now, there are some really big things happening. I'm putting together all of the course materials for the official Project Tempest program. So if that's something you're interested in, make sure you jump in the group. I'm going to give 10 people access to the program before everyone else and they're going to get it at a ridiculously discounted rate. So make sure you're in there so you know when that's coming. It's going to be 90 days to upgrade your mindset, expand your emotions, increase your energy, create clarity so that you can actually become limitless. It really is going to be something special. So make sure you hit those call to actions and get inside the group. I will see you in the group.